So you've connected your iPhone 12 to the MagSafe charger and the device is not charging although the MagSafe animation and the charging icons are displayed. I'm Vlad from iPhoneTricks.org and I'll show you how to fix iPhone 12 not charging when connected to the MagSafe pack. More than 40 minutes later and almost nothing has changed, just a 2% increase in battery charge and uh, the iPhone is also quite cold over here usually when charging occurs it warms up the first thing that you can do to fix this is to tap the battery icon in the status bar if a ray spring occurs like here it means that a glitch was preventing MagSafe charging from working as it should so give it a little bit of time and see if this helps another way to fix it is to force restart your iPhone with the MagSafe pack connected to it. So what you have to do is press volume up, volume down, and then press and hold the side button until the screen turns black and the Apple, a white Apple logo appears on the screen. Okay, right now release. The iPhone will reboot and let's see if MagSafe charging will resume but it's important to have it here connected, your iPhone connected to the pack because else a reboot won't help too much. Okay, so let's see, I have to put the passcode because of the restart. It's strange, now the percentage is down to 67%, but I have charging indication. Let me tap it once again, the battery icon. Okay, so no rest spring. I, I think it should work. I'll wait a couple of more minutes and update you. Okay, three minutes passed and we're already up to 70%. So 3% increase in battery charge in three minutes. And I can also feel that the iPhone is getting warm. So charging is occurring. Okay, so the fix work. If your iPhone still continues not to charge after applying these two fixes. You should check the MagSafe charger with a different iPhone to see if the problem persists or your iPhone with a secondary MagSafe charger to eliminate like any potential hardware problems. If you have a hardware issue, most likely Apple will uh, replace uh, that part without any cost. Also, if you're charging wirelessly via MagSafe, while using a compatible MagSafe case. Make sure to remove the case and try again. To eliminate any potential problem caused by the accessory. If this video was useful to you, don't hesitate to like, share and subscribe to our YouTube channel for more tips, tricks and fixes. See you in the next one. Bye bye.